Good evening, everyone, and uh, another update on the English Civil War project. This is the 1st Regiment of Pike done. This is Prince Rupert's blue coats. As you can see, they're in their blue coats. So, uh, divided up into three. This is on an 80 by 80 base, so that the pikes, when they connect with the enemy, for example, two bases connecting like this, they're able to snug in nice and neat there. Uh, so these are holding uh, at port and at charge, I believe is the uh, the phrase. And uh, enjoyed painting these up. Lots of detail. Uh, so that's the front rank, back rank, standing at ease. Um, the straps were a little bit of a pain to get right, but um, do it nonetheless. And then a command stand, uh, just four models. And I went for the furled colours uh, for this unit because the command stand that I have already has Prince Rupert's colours unfurled. So. And I imagine that they're just different stages, perhaps. Maybe these are still marching into position. I don't know. But um, I took this idea from Seventh Son, which is before they engage, the commander's leading from the front, and then once they meet with the enemy, they do the colours to the rear, which was a tactic that they used. So, uh, yeah. On next in the painting desk is two wings of muskets. So, 24 musket men to paint. And uh, that will be the first battalion done for the Royalists. Because along with the blue coats, we've got some cavalry. Which you've already seen before. And a small firelock storming party. So two wings of muskets uh, along with them, the commander, and that's a nice little force as well. And here we've got, as well to be painted, old Rupert himself. So lots to be cracking on with, loving this project. Uh, the models are, there's nice variation in different things. So you've got, you know, some models with metal, some models without metal, and then horse, uh, so yeah, loads to be at. Uh, that's all for me for this time, guys. Um, stay safe and happy wargaming.